Ponderon will return to the old ways, the pure ways. Your blood will wash away centuries of desecration. You don't fight for Onderon. You fight for your own bigoted agenda. You fight, and you lose. His loss is my gain, I bet. I've beaten you. I've won. Did you really believe you could steal the throne of the great King Petrif? Steal your throne? What in blazes are you talking about? No sense lying now. Your treason is over. I've won. You... you fight for the Empire. Petrif, what have you done? I have secured the prosperity of my planet forever. Now I rule Onderon, not the Republic and not you. You're a pawn, Petrif. Don't you see? You've doomed our world! A Republic senator is a valuable prisoner. We look forward to learning everything you know. I knew you were a fool. But I never dreamed you could do something like this. I can do anything, Mabet. I am king. King! You! Step forward! Your service to my rule shall never be forgotten. The people of Onderon will cheer your heroism for centuries to come. I'm sure you'll be the one they yell about for years to come. Now yes, perhaps so. Now then, so many matters to attend to. I must take stock of things. Please, inform Darth Savick of our great victory. I've confirmed it with my own sensors. Total destruction of all Republic ships in orbit. And without a single Imperial casualty. You have served your empire well indeed, Savik. Empress Asina will reward your ingenuity and loyalty. Savik has done an excellent job. Her plan was well conceived and flawlessly executed. Without you, this would not have been possible. I am fortunate to have worked alongside you. With Petrif as our puppet ruler, Onderon's resources will help ensure the empire's future. Resources are not our most urgent concern, Savik. You will depart for Corellia at once. Yes, Lord Malgus. Another fleet of Republic reinforcements is docking at Megshar, as Darth Valron predicted. That will be your next target. Ensure another victory, and the Republic will have no hope of stopping us. So, what's our next stop? Set course for Megshar. Ah! We know it well. A mined-out asteroid converted into a fueling station. <coughs> We'd love to join you. If you think your alliance has room, of course. Please? Please? It's been a pleasure working with you again. Welcome to the Alliance. Wonderful. <coughs> I have a shuttle prepped and ready, shall we? Welcome to Meg Shah, outlaw crossroads of the galaxy. Darth Shah. I'm pleased we finally have an opportunity to work together. I've heard such delicious things about you. I serve Darth Valron, head of Imperial Logistics and Civil Order. He asked that I aid in supervising this operation due to my experience with the galaxy's criminal element. This intriguing specimen is a member of the Brothers. 
are key allies on the station. They've provided the Empire with quality slave labor for many years. It is our great honor to take those without value and give them value, to give labor to those without purpose. It's good to work with such loyal supporters of the Empire. Loyal and deferential. The ideal partners for a mission like ours. Our goal here is more complex than it might seem. Let's step into the operations center to discuss the details. Wait. This is... <gasps> what? this was that I have no idea but I appreciate the help anytime it's good to see you again Lord Shah still in one piece oh oh yes the force was strong with him but he didn't stand a chance for a Sith to defy the Empress and attack you during a top priority mission you must have done something truly stirring. He was no match for me, and he knew it. Let's get back to the mission. If he tries again, I'll just kill him. I'm going to enjoy working with you so much. Shall we? Greetings. I am Darth Varon of the Dark Council. It is a pleasure to have you join us for this mission. I overheard something of a commotion. Is everything all right? Someone attempted to kill our dear guest. An assassination attempt? Dreadful. I do apologize. Are there no guards posted? No security? How could someone like that get in here unnoticed? You're quite right. I shall personally ensure that security measures are tripled for the remainder of our time here. Now then, Char, let's go over what we've planned. A Republic fleet key to the defense of Corellia has taken position nearby and intends to purchase fuel from Mekshar in order to continue their journey. It is our task to ensure that this fleet never reaches its destination. So we stop them from refueling. Unfortunately, that wouldn't fulfill our Empress's command. If the fleet cannot acquire fuel, they'll simply consolidate what fuel they have into their most powerful warships and send them on. We do not have sufficient vessels to prevent this, and we must make every effort to stop the entire fleet. Then we lure them in and attack while they transfer the fuel. Just so, my friend. Major Anri, explain your discovery. It just so happens that a perfect weapon is built into this rock, all we have to do is take control of it. See, this place used to belong to the Huts, till their slaves revolted and kicked them out. Now Mekshar's neutral, run by the five biggest crews on the station. Hutbreaker, she led the revolt. Well, she wanted to be sure nobody could show up and steal what she and the other slaves just won. So they put in a failsafe. It fires a pulse that neutralizes all the fuel in Mekshar's tanks, plus whatever's in the fuel lines, and any ships attached. We could even juice the pulse up a bit. Make it strong enough to ignite the fuel everywhere but the tanks. Fry every ship in the fleet. Perfect. How do we get started? The decision of whether to sell fuel to the Republic fleet hasn't been made yet. It depends on a majority vote by the top five crews. It falls to you to persuade them to vote in favor of selling the fuel. To help the Republic walk into our trap. Fortunately, you have the perfect opportunity to get started. Brother? Hutbreaker hosts a celebration, an auction of pointless material wealth gained without effort. The five strongest crews are invited. 
you join our dear friends at Hutbreaker's auction, ensure that the crews vote in favor of selling the fuel, and help the Republic slip its head into the noose. Consider it done, Lord Char. If any other developments occur in the meantime, we will inform you at once. And watch your back. At least one of these crews is already in the Republic's corner, or the fleet wouldn't have come here in the first place. Best of luck. Fancy meeting you here, boss. We were catching up with Theron and Lana, and they mentioned you were here. Figured we'd lend a hand. We've cut a few deals with these people over the years. With our help, you'll know just how to play them. They'll vote however you want. I'll be glad to have any information you can give me. Just doing our part. If you're ready, let's head inside. All right, first up, Hotbreaker, revolutionary leader, liberator, and unofficial queen of Mech Shah. Her crew runs the main docks. She won't need much convincing. Selling that fuel will bring in a small fortune, but that only stands if you keep the peace. You get too messy with any of these gangs, Hutbreaker will lock things down no matter how much she stands to make. Keeping Mech Shah safe is her top priority. All right. Darth Shah said that one of the crew leaders is a Republic sympathizer. What can you tell me? Junker Jot, retired Republic Navy. His people handle maintenance for all of Mech Shah. They're the reason we've got air to breathe and a nice view that doesn't kill us. Jot doesn't really have a crew, just droids and other engineers like him. But without them, this place literally doesn't work. So they get a seat at the table. Needless to say, the Republic will get his vote to refuel, so no need to get involved there. Better to focus on the other crew leaders. Why bother with the others? Hutbreaker and Jot will vote in the Republic's favor. We tell the brothers to do the same, and we have a majority. The brothers' relationship with the Empire is no secret. If they suddenly vote to sell fuel to the Republic, it will seem way too suspicious. Yeah, it's more of a hassle, but you'll need a vote from one of the other crew leaders to keep the Republic from looking too closely. First is Veek the Snake. He runs a Rodian smuggling ring, the Harido Wald, one of the biggest operations in the galaxy. Veek's a businessman. He can be anybody's friend if there's an upshot for him. Just have to figure out what he needs and make sure he gets it. The other crew leader is Indigo, Mandalorian. Well, ex-Mandalorian. Same with his crew. They're called something like Dar... Dharma... Darm... Darmanda. They're mercs and gun runners. Indigo has some kind of rivalry with Veek, so it's a good thing you only need one of them to vote your way. Veek or Indigo. Simple enough. Thank you for your help. What are friends for? Looks like Hutbreaker's about to give her big welcome speech. Let's find a good spot. Meksha! How are you doing tonight? <laughs> Look at us! We are surviving! We are thriving! We are turning this tiny rock into the beating heart of the galaxy! Just a few years ago. We were slaves! Now, we're masters! Imagine what we can become in just a few more years! All we've got to do is stay us! Be what we've been so far! We keep the peace, we keep the balance, and we keep moving forward! We've got the whole galaxy laid out in front of us! Everyone else just doesn't see it yet! All they see are the soldiers, politicians, Sith, Jedi. All the people who think they run things, who think their wars decide who's in charge. The truth is, they'll never be in charge. They'll never really run things. You know why? Because while they're busy killing each other, we're making deals, making friends, expanding everything they buy so they can blow each other up. We're selling and getting richer, stronger. By the time they stop and do the math, it will be too late, because there will be a lot more of us than there are of them. And then it will be us calling the shots. So stay the course, my friends. 
It only gets better from here! <laughs> Welcome to Meksha. Did you enjoy the speech? I think you're one good blockade away from realizing who's actually in charge. You think you can spare the ships it would take? How many planets would you be willing to lose to prove a point? Buffing up your chest at me won't get you anywhere. In the meantime, enjoy our hospitality. Have a drink on me, and keep the peace. You can keep the peace, yes. I have your Sith friend's word on it. The Sith aren't known for keeping their word or keeping the peace. Such cynicism! Commander, meet Tawi there, Jedi Knight. Leave while you can, Jedi. I won't tell you again. I don't answer to you. The two of us have a prior appointment, I'm afraid. Please, enjoy the auction. I know you helped Malgus on Osis. You picked the wrong side. And you're going to regret it. The Republic is never going to win. You must see that. What I see is one more Imperial lapdog. Master Jedi. See you around. Keep on walking, I got nothing to say to imp lovers. Chunky Faguta de Obora Geoto Kakise. De Mote Kikasa, do Bonilis de Oto. Chai con Kunta Chichai. It depends on how well you treat your friends. Makipuna Mali Tuta, o Nishka. Conchita Chichakta. Kusa Malachikuta, y Kosa Mose Alachuta. Kobane Puta, Taise Jeskusku. I'm curious. What's your stance on fueling the Republic ships? Kasu yali koyarang kenka kurun. Klis kataka yos bosko uko pokuta. Makipu na mali tuta o nishka. Mitisa roda kopana chaporko utman gisa. It'd be better to discuss this in private. Bampaula kava ji oto. What do you have in mind? Chubula wa mi chade sula. Kastu undile, jingo hola lukuta. Tungi machechu, kuti nanki he. Wana wa de bloto wichawa. What do you want? To the point. Let me return the favor. I'm looking for some help. Interested? You think Darmanda want to fight and die in your little war? You're out of your mind. We're doing just fine on Meksha. Who are the Darmanda anyway? What's your story? Give me a break. I saw your friends feed you intel on everyone in here earlier. What's a point in a whispering? You know who we are. I'd rather hear what people have to say about themselves. Look, you want to talk business, we can do that, but not here. Meet me at the cantina later, and we'll see. Ah, there you are. Have you learned everything you need to complete our plan? Yes. I'm done here. Splendid. I hope your time was... illuminating. How'd I do? Too scruffy? Just scruffy enough? That's Nova Blade gear. What are you planning? Gonna do a hit and run on Jot's turf a bit later. Need to keep the old crank from realizing who's behind it. Just need a few more sets of gear for the rest of my boys and we'll be off. I've rather loudly let the actual Nova Blades, as well as the Exchange, hear that I'm hiring extra muscle. Word should spread quickly. 
I am on my way to meet with one of the crews we need to vote for the refueling. Wonderful. My master knew you were the one for the job. Well then, we all have our tasks before us. Shall we reconvene in the Brothers' territory later? Chunky Faguta, Geopora, Geoto Kakise. Makipun Malituta, or Mishka. We're not friends. Just tell me how you're going to help. In a good daiji, Liska Chanangawa. Makuta Pal could chop the Wampa, La Guakilia Jacoska. Chunky Faguta, Geopora, Geoto Kakise. Who do you support? Akmanoya, no chahaita. Tuta mishka, no chahaita. Kafst undile, jigo hola lukuta. What makes you think I want to stop it? Togawa, ki kuba kili. Koya maya, inacho kasa. Jakusa mala jakuta, ikosa mose ala tuta. Patogawa ki kuba kile. Why me? Can't your own people handle it? Ki kasa da yaka toto. Umpa bitwala bitwala ni bobo. Koya tuka changa kapula. Dimuti ki kasa do boni lis di woto. Bampa ula kava ji oto. Umpa bitwala bitwala ni bobo. You want to do business with the huts? Bagsra wana waka. Mi buna wadi te utwipi. Kasu yali koyarang kenka kurung. Umpa ta ti tok maki chisa chubala wawuni. I didn't know the exchange was on Meksha. Kuchuso, you mata chiko toya. Mata humpa, muli ravavaba. Umpa bitwala, bitwala ni bobo. Nokta chulna do beyala. Patoga wa, ki kuba kili. I'll bring the envoy back, safe and sound. Kuchuso, you mata chiko toya. Cha aita ye chopa. Mitwana Shoto. Papa Mechispa. You weren't invited to this meeting, Commander. I gather your meeting with Vika is cancelled, then? Kava ji ota tako gauta no pisto pampa wuta. I must say... I am surprised Veek chose his reputation over saving a potential deal with the Huts. Kota chota, kasa yuli koira tole kankiton. So this was just a way to get back at Veek. Doti puna puna, manchika pugnoni slimo. In truth. Both of our organizations lose millions of credits to Harido Wald every month. It's getting expensive. Kiko ubo kili wata ponka tonko potoko wata. Once Veek and his ilk are out of the way, we'll divvy up his roots and cruise between ourselves. Yako pa chiji kuting and nulia makachisa. Kuchuso, you mata chiko toya. Mikushu funbu dopa makma. Dead. It was an ambush. She was working with the exchange all along. Bampa ula kava ji oto. The huts and the exchange made a deal to kill you and split your resources between themselves. They didn't count on anyone else getting involved. Kasu yali koyarang kenka kurung. Umpa kumbak, niji tonka giliski chanaka. Umpa bitwala, bitwala ni bobo. I don't think you'll ever make that happen. Chonki faguta, jiopora, jeoto kakise. Chukusa mala chikuta, ikosa mose ala tuta. Umpa bitwala, bitwala ni bobo. Uidok bamba, unaguta, tankwe kuta. 
You sent me into an ambush. If you need protection from anyone, it's me. It's exactly what I need. Yana kuzu pike no ye nevuta nakma. Almost. It would be a shame if anyone found out about you and the huts. Patonka, joto ke kwanga chuska no chachiwanga. Whatever the Empire wants, you will supply for them. Understand? Chonki faguta jiobora jioto kakise. I look forward to hearing the outcome of the fuel vote. The moti kikasa do bonilis di woto. Good. Commander, am I interrupting anything? I just finished convincing Vig to support our plan. What do you need? Perfect. Remember when I mentioned that hit and run on Jot's territory earlier? Well, I've got my squad ready to move. Last thing we need is you. What do you mean? Jot's crew handles maintenance for everything in the station, including the failsafe system that roasts the fuel. He'll have a schematic for the failsafe on his computers. We need that data so we can modify the system to juice it up like the boss wants. My team hits Jot's place first, so he thinks pirates are trying to run off with some of his repair droids. While he's out chasing us around, you sneak into his HQ and grab the data. Sound good? Send me the coordinates and I'll make my way there. You got it. Before we dive into this op, I have to tell you, I feel like Valron's playing games here. Treating those creep slavers like they actually matter. Hell, playing nice with any of the locals. Boss's eyes are on more than just the mission, I'm sure of it. You were a slave once. How do you feel about slavery in the Empire? Being a slave was horrible. But it motivated me to be the best. To make myself more. That's what the Empire's all about, isn't it? Still, if things had been different, I could have got a lot more years soldiering in. Probably a lot of good soldiers died working in a mine or something before they got their chance to really make a difference. The weak are meant to serve the strong. The Empire wouldn't exist without slaves. It's as simple as that. If we fall apart without them, maybe they aren't the weak ones. All right, I burned enough of your time. I'll move my people into position and we'll be ready to start when you are. Amory out. Major Anri, I'm downloading the failsafe schematics now. Copy that. I think we finally have the old fool locked down. Gonna snag some droids and make our getaway before he gets loose again. Henry out. Running off, eh? I'm not done with ya! Deploy the big fellas! All of them! Thanks to your impressive efforts, the vote has gone as we intended. Mekshar will sell fuel to the Republic. Their ships are preparing to dock now. All without the slightest idea of our true plans. Well done. We can begin our attack as soon as their ships are locked in. I've gone over the failsafe schematics with my boys. We'll break into the maintenance shafts and hit the four main emitters all at once. Someone else will have to throw the big switch, though. Can't activate the failsafe from inside. Has to be done from the dock's control center. Leave that to me. We're of the same mind. Excellent. Before you begin, I will load the remainder of our troops into assault shuttles and make a diversionary strike on the docks themselves. That should serve to distract the bulk of their defenders. Still, do be careful as you approach the failsafe controls, darling. Don't worry. You won't need to distract them for long. Splendid. Oh, to see their ships gutted by the very fuel that they were so desperate to acquire. This will be a glorious day for the Empire. A day to be exceeded only by our forthcoming victory on Karelia. Now then, everyone to your tasks. Take no prisoners, and above all else, enjoy yourselves.
I've reached the failsafe controls. And this is the Vulcan modified. We're ready. Perfect. Activate the failsafe. Firing now. Return to base. You made an all-out military assault on my docks! Meksha isn't Imperial territory! You don't get to ignore my rules! It is true that our forces attack their ships, as they do in all corners of the galaxy. But it was your council that voted to put them in that position. And it was your weapon that shredded their ships so spectacularly. No! They'll never think that we have been working together since the beginning. That is exactly what they'll think. Why else would you be meeting us now? You have made an enemy of the Republic. Your neutrality will be meaningless. But? You are not alone in these trying times. Your affiliation with the Empire will gradually strengthen over time. I believe you could become our key refueling station in this sector. If you learn to behave. We don't need the scum. We should detonate the whole place and be done with it. I'm sure we won't need to resort to such drastic alternatives. Will we? No. Splendid. You may go now. Varon, Shah, report. The Republic fleet has been all but eradicated. They will not trouble you on Corellia. Then your mission is complete. Prepare to extract all forces. With no further Republic reinforcements to contend with, our victory on Corellia is all but guaranteed. I'm transmitting coordinates now. We will meet to discuss our strategy for the attack immediately. Malgus out. It has been a great pleasure working with you, Commander. I shall look forward to our next mission together. My lords. Orders just came through. Looks like I'm backing you up on Corellia. Heard they have good whiskey. Might try and grab some. Don't bother. Kalsinor's blends are just as good, and much simpler to find in Imperial space. Maybe so. But you know what they say about a looted bottle. The truest taste of victory. Oh, I like this one. I've enjoyed working with her so far. Major Henri, this is Lana Benico. Charmed. Hey, I saw the Sith leave. Am I clear to come in now? One of yours? Most of the time. Are we good to go or what? This is not the best neighborhood. Lead the way. <laughs> 